947 on this Saturday, the first Saturday in August. What better day to talk about a pickle garden? And <laughs> I don't know what's happening here, but unimagined it today, we have the mind of Carl Nelson is growing something delightful. What, what is going on here? He's got a lot of pickles. Okay. And you know, at the Science Center, we're always looking for creative, unusual ways to get people excited about science. Yeah. And what better way to talk about electricity and computer programming than pickles. Why are pickles so funny? They're, they're just fun. All right. They're just fun. <laughs> okay. And the neat thing about pickles and electricity is they're conductive. Yeah. Right? You soak them in that brine and they pick up ions that can conduct electricity. So I've arranged a variety of pickles here <laughs> on some forks. Tony, why don't you just go ahead and touch some of the pickles. Touch the tops of these pickles? Yeah, anywhere. Oh my gosh. We can do it at the same time too. You have, that's a. <laughs> <laughs> tickling the ivories. <laughs> tickling the pickles there, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> so what I've done here is connected up each pickle to this little microcomputer board. Okay. okay. It's really simple stuff. And what you can do is it's programmed that when you touch a pickle, go ahead and touch one, you become part of the circuit. It can detect that, and I've programmed it to play a different note for each pickle. Wow. Now, if you really want to have fun with this, you can pick these up on the Internet. They're relatively inexpensive. It's a great introduction to interfacing the real world with computer programming. Really? Right? If you wanted to, Tony, you could take this rig home and yeah. touch this pickle, open the garage door, touch this one, <laughs> feed the cat and dog. I don't, you can do all sorts of really cool stuff with a very simple micro programming board. It's like, like a villain's lair. You know, you'd sit there with your board of pickles. <laughs> and I like the fact that you can touch, you know, you can do two at the same time. Yeah. Right? So you're not limited to just one. So again, just the... Oh, nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> So just a fun way to get people excited about electricity and circuits in a sort of a non-traditional way. Now another thing that we like to do at the Science Center that is a little bit more fun than even that is take a pickle, and this is one you're not going to want to touch, and you're not going to want to do this at home. Okay. Do this at home okay. or come to the Science Center. Got it. This pickle, hit that button there, Tony. All right, just push down on it. Push down and hold it down. Whoa! 110 volts on either side of the pickle. We're heating up the pickle juice inside. That's the steam coming off. <laughs> and as it dries out, there is going to be some sparks happening inside there. Yeah, look at that. We're sending a significant amount of current through that pickle. As it dries out, there's arcs, there are sparks. Kind of a fun way to talk about maybe the electric pickle, the pickle light bulb. Let's see, wow. jam it a little bit. There we go. There we go. That pickle is lighting up. It's lighting up. So again, don't try this at home, but certainly come down and check out the pickle piano. <laughs> try it out. You can do a lot of fun stuff with it. And you can maybe even check out the electric pickle as well. But again, just a fun way to get people excited about learning a little bit about technology, yeah. circuits, programming, and of course, who doesn't like a sparking pickle? I'm just wondering how long this will last. Does it dry out at some point? It'll go. Those sparks are actually caused because we are boiling away some of the liquid. And so the arc is happening in between there. Eventually, you'll get it so dry that it won't be able to sustain an arc across the pickle, and then it'll stop. Okay. But yeah, we can even maybe. There we hey. go. Get a little bit closer. <laughs> lots, of, lots of fun Steven stuff there. Steaming pickle. It smells like Tony Paco's in here. How about that? Hey. Just don't touch the pickle, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Well, fun stuff here. Yeah. We so picked definitely. a peck of pickled peppers and we've <laughs> made them musical and smoking. Smoking Absolutely. pickles. So, Lucas County residents, 1200, getting free today. It's Saturday. Come on down, check out, again, the, the pickle piano. You might as well just take this, take this piano down to the Science Center and have it hooked up today because it's, people are going to want to see this. That's where it's going, right <laughs> after I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> Thanks very much from the mind of Carl Nelson. Once again, here's the address. <laughs> for the Imagination Station, One Discovery Way, as you mentioned, they are open today, right now, in fact, until 5 o'clock. So head on down there, take the kids, don't touch the electric pickle. That is this week's Imagine It. We're going to turn it now over to the guys in sports. <laughs>